hello hello and welcome to my channel happy friday i didn't think i would be doing two what sold videos in a week but we have over three thousand dollars shipping out and i just had to show you there is two thousand dollars going out on ebay over thirteen hundred dollars going out on etsy plus we have a poshmark and a mercari sale and i'm really excited to show you because there's some great items in here so let's go all right so up first on ebay is actually a viewer sale it's going out to miss meredith so miss meredith thank you so much for your purchase these are really really cute miss meredith picked up these three stained glass mushroom sun catchers look at the glass on that one it's really really neat and then this one is kind of a slag glass and this one i lotted the three up together miss meredith got them for 13 dollars Plus she paid six in shipping. Hopefully those will be under a pound. They might not be, but I am about three to $4 into those and they're about an $8 profit. So again, thank you so much for your purchase, Miss Meredith. And then we sold this sterling silver bracelet here. It does have blue stones, kind of hard to see. It is clearly marked 925 right there on the clasp this one sold for 23.38 plus the buyer paid five in shipping i paid about five dollars so that one is about a 14 dollar profit next is a great sale and i was surprised it sold so fast this is a vintage brass serving tray which is really really cool and this brings up so in my research video you will be seeing next week I'm going to go over mid-century modern and some brass can be big money this tray sold for 35 dollars i got it for less than five so it's about a 25 dollar profit and it sold in under a week next is a little ornament and i tell you guys all the time i like selling little vintage ornaments they may not sell for much but they're really easy to list and ship this is a little plush teddy bear wearing a little reindeer costume this one was made in china so don't necessarily discount that they still might sell this one sold for six dollars and 48 cents plus the buyer paid five in shipping so it is going to be about a four dollar profit and it sold in under a month all right this next one might surprise you it is a barbie item it's a barbie mcdonald so this is like the little drive through sign with the little lamps this McDonald's sign sold for $32, $32 bucks in under a month. I will tell you that whole drive through set is worth a ton of money if you find it. Just that one piece sold for $32. I am only a couple dollars in. That one is about a $25 profit and it sold really, really fast. Up next is an item that took a little while to sell. I got it in a lot. I was kind of on the fence about whether to list it or not. I'm only a couple dollars in and this little pewter serving tray with the flower there sold for $13. This one is marked on the bottom continental silver. Not sure if you can see it there. So it took about a year to sell and it sold for 13. So it's about a $5 profit. Up next is the first of the license plates. This is actually the first motorcycle plate we have sold. We just listed quite a few motorcycle plates. So hopefully some more of them will be selling. This one is an Indiana 1990 little motorcycle tag. This one sold for $7 and I'm about a dollar into each of these. This one will be about a $4 profit. I do want to tell you, cause I was kind of curious where I was at on the license plates. So the first of the license plates actually were listed exactly a month ago today. I paid $1,000 for close to 2,000 of them. We have sold $1,700 and $34.66 worth of license plates. So if I subtract 20% for fees, which is what I typically do, that leaves me with $1,387 in 30 days that I have made on the license plate. So in under a month, they are already in the profit and we still have hundreds of them left, which is absolutely amazing. And up next is another license plate. This is a protect the panther florida tag 2002 this one sold for 1624 so this one is going to be about a 12 dollar profit up next is another sun catcher this is a little kind of turquoise blue 
just the nugget and that's what I put I put Suncatcher turquoise nugget this one sold for $11 plus the buyer paid six in shipping so this one is going to be about an $8 profit and sold in under a week up next is the little devil literally it's the little devil this is a Harvey Tunes little devil there's your tag this one i paid about five dollars for he sold for 15.58 he took about six or eight months to sell quite a while but he's about a seven dollar profit and then another license plate this one is a 1970 virginia tag this one sold for 775 it is about a four dollar profit so there are some lower dollar tags in there which i am okay with because there are also high dollar ones anytime you buy a big lot of one type of item you're bound to have lower dollar and hopefully you will have some higher dollar as well and then we have another license plate coming in at 20 dollars this one is a 1967 Kentucky license plate. This one sold for 20, so it is about a $15 profit. And then I'm gonna pop a picture up because this one, it's actually in that box right, right there. I used the Christmas tree as a example for my insta foam so it's already packed, which is great because that would have been the hardest thing to pack today. So that Christmas tree that you see up there sold for $110.48 plus the buyer paid 15 in shipping. Hopefully I am good with that. Now that one is going out to a viewer. It is going out to Miss Cindy. So Miss Cindy, thank you so much for your purchase. She heard me talking about that ceramic Christmas tree on my live Tuesday night and realized that my Christmas tree was one she had been watching. So she went ahead and purchased it. That one I did pay $25 for it. So it is about a $50 profit. Miss Cindy, thank you so much for your purchase. And then we have another stained glass. This is a Masonic symbol. I did not know that. I used Google Lens to identify it. It picked it up fast. This one sold in under a week for $19.49. So this one is about a $15 profit and the buyer did pay six in shipping. And then we've got some clothes. I did pay about a dollar for this set in a buyout. I bought a ton of stuff from somebody whose mother passed away. So I was let go in the house, get whatever I wanted. I paid a bulk price. This is John Roberts and it's actually this really pretty shirt as well as a long skirt. It's a full length skirt. This set sold for $19.48. So it's about a $15 profit. That one did take about five months to sell. And then we have another license plate. This one is Maryland. This one's from 1969. This one sold for $14.61. So it is about an $8 profit. And then I sold a dress. I'm selling a lot of clothes today. Three, three clothing items are going out, which I don't sell a ton of clothes, but they are pretty easy to list and they're definitely easy to ship. So I'm okay with them. This one I paid a dollar for as well. This one is Kate Lee. It is a really pretty gray and pink flower dress. This one sold for $16.56, so it's about a $14 profit. That one, again, took a little bit longer to sell, so clothing items for me typically do take longer. That one's about a $14 profit. All right, up next is one of the two big sales. There are two sales on this video for over $1,200. This is a Shriner New York brooch. Now the kicker with this one is it, it has a crack there on the bottom that I did not see when I bought this in an online auction. It's a gorgeous brooch as you can see. I paid almost $800 for this brooch. Got so excited I saw Shriner New York which I will show you there the marking up top. It is stamped right here Shriner New York. Got so excited I didn't look close at the pictures to notice that it had a chip on the main stone. So I thought I could get about $2,000 for it, which would have been a great return paying 800. Instead, it was cracked. I noticed when I photographed it and somebody sent me an offer for 1200. I pretty quickly accepted. I'm only making about $200 on it, but I'm happy to get my initial investment back plus a little bit of profit. And it's still a great sale at 1200. So if you do not know and have not watched my brooch videos, Shriner New York is one of the top brands for brooches. So definitely keep your eye out for those. 
And then we have a New Jersey plate going out. This is a 1971 New Jersey. This one sold for $25.99. What made this one sell for a little more is it was a used car dealer. So again, if you find these license plates with special stuff like used car dealer, dealer, most of those are worth a little bit more than a basic plate. Sold for $25.99. It's about a $20 profit and it sold in under a week. And then we have another dress this is a this is a really cool dress this has got the little tropical fish on it swimming all around really really cool this one the brand is kim rogers size medium and again same buyout of clothes and i paid about a dollar this one sold for 19.48 so it is about a 14 dollar profit again took over six months to sell and then this license plate look, looks really, really cool. I thought it would go for more, but this one only sold for $12.99. Still not bad, coming in at about a $9 profit. Sold really fast in under a week. And then we have two Harley pins. They did sell to the same buyer. This one here with the Harley Davidson with the wings. This Harley pen sold for $12.98. And then this one with the Eagle sold for $13. So between the two of them, I'm $2 in and it's about a $15 profit. Another license plate. This one is uh, 1973 Colorado sold for $8.77. So it's about a $5 profit. We had a lot, a lot of sales. Kind of crazy. I will, I will tell on myself. There is so much going out today because I went out on the boat yesterday. We went scalloping. We found zero goose egg. Zero scallops. Zero scallops. But... Brad caught a gag grouper. Unfortunately, it was three inches too small to be able to keep. Otherwise, I could have had a good grouper dinner last night. So we kind of struck out yesterday on the boat, but we had a great time swimming in the ocean. We saw a four-foot loggerhead sea turtle. Absolutely amazing. So it was a great day, even though we didn't bring home dinner. Still a fun day, and we're going to try scalloping again next week. Scallop season lasts three months. I, I will find the scallops. I will find them. And then we have this cute little goose glass ornament. This one sold for $9.43. I paid a dollar. So this one's about a $7 profit. Buyer did pay five in shipping. And then another license plate. This is a Virginia 1972. This one sold for $7.25. So it is about a $4 profit. So again, there are some lower cost plates. I price them where I think they will sell and in multi-quantity that profit definitely adds up next is some plates i found at goodwill they sold in about three months these are they caught my eye because they're so bright these are certified international by nancy green square plates i paid three dollars at goodwill the two of them sold for 32 dollars and 48 cents watch for plates watch for plates if it catches your eye look it up that one is about a 25 dollar profit and then another license plate. This one is a 1972 Florida, sold for $15.95. That one's about a $12 profit. This next sale is probably going to blow your mind. These are, unless you like these candles, then you know how much they cost. These are Woodwick Candles White Teak. They do have the teak top and they do have a teak, teak wick as well. These two candles sold for $58. I do have two of them. $58.48. I paid $10 for them at a garage sale. Five a piece. I actually bought out all of their Woodwick candles. So these two are about a $35 profit and they sold in about three months. So not too long, but watch for candles that are new because some of them can be big money. Last on eBay before I show you the incredible incredible Etsy sales as well as Poshmark and Mercari. It's this really cool Dive in the Bahamas little wallet. I got this in a lot so I'm pennies in. It sold for $4.50. It took about eight months to sell. It's about a three dollar profit. So let's take a look at what sold on Poshmark, Etsy, and Mercari. So I was I was a little upset about this. One of my listers put all of these together. There are nine ruby red glass pieces i typically will not list more than four glass pieces in a lot because they are a pain in the butt to ship one of my listers did didn't ask me how i want it separated 
it was done so i just let it be sold for 35 dollars over on poshmark i'm only a couple dollars in so that one's about a 25 dollar profit and then these are really cool so these are valances with horses running they do have tassels it is a set of curtains and i got them in like a western lot in an online auction didn't pay very much those curtains which it is two panels two valances they sold for 25 dollars on mercari they are going to be about a 15 dollar profit and they sold in under a day from being listed on mercari so that is our second sale since we have been back on mercari and i'm happy to have added another platform definitely definitely helps as far as the sales all right i'm going to post a picture up here we sold a beater lack blanket on etsy for 60 dollars. i paid four dollars at the thrift store this is just a simple leaf blanket it was rolled up when i bought it again only paid about four dollars but it was a great sale and over a 40 dollar profit on etsy it sold in about a month all right last if you were watching my tuesday night live you would have seen when i made this sale on etsy this is a randy rhodes this is rock icons this statue sold for twelve hundred and nineteen dollars on etsy i paid four hundred for him in an online auction so this is over a six hundred dollar profit and it sold in about three months so to those of you that were in my live buying class earlier today i hope you enjoyed it i showed how i find items like that and if you were not you can pay to watch the replay live buying masterclass how to buy inventory for your business it is available on my website the nurseflipper.bigcartel.com as well as last week's class on organization i will go ahead i'm going to go ahead and give you guys a spoiler the class for next week is going to be keywords that is something a lot of people struggle with and that is one of my strong suits that i feel like helps me get more sales and be consistent and make a good amount of money on ebay so we are still maintaining between between 10 and 12,000 a month when we have these big sales though it'll kick us up close to that twenty thousand dollar a month mark which is absolutely amazing i have behaved for a month now and not done any sourcing which is really really hard but i'm going to try and continue as i work through my death pile i had a ton of bags there i've got all those listed so now i'm starting to work on the back half of my shed i hope you guys had a great week happy friday enjoy your weekend spend some time with family i will be doing my live sourcing tomorrow night that is where i put in your zip code and look for items in your area for you to resell so those of you that are my live sourcing members check the community tab put in your zip code so i can look for you if you are not a paid member of the channel definitely hit that join button below any video and i will go over the different levels of membership for you and we have our live ebay store reviews coming up next week as well so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i had to share it was just way too much really really good stuff going out way too much money to not share it with you I, again, hope you have a great weekend. I will see my live sourcing members tomorrow night at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. The rest of you, I will see you on Monday and watch for that keyword masterclass to be listed on my Big Cartel site. Bye for now, guys.